And look what I found. A piece of glass. Look at his leg right there. That means his leg is probably cut. What the heck? Both of her hands and feet are covered. So this is so strange. Knuckles. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, oh so my cute. little buddy. Good morning, MTM fam. Welcome to the vlog today. Um, I'm being extra chipper because I'm faking it. Do you ever have those days that you just have to fake it? I kind of <laughs> am having a bad attitude today. And um, it's nobody's fault, nobody did anything, it's just sort of me. And I'm gonna be working on shaking that. I think I got off on the wrong foot this morning because this is the problem with like comparing yourself with others is I kind of got in a grouchy mood and I feel I really feel guilty even admitting this but because I was just looking at YouTube and looking over channels and I feel like we have been working like Dance. we have dancer. been doing this That's for a long time we've been doing it for about four years and we've been doing it we just came to the park to years. have a picnic we've had our channel for four years and it sometimes gets hard and frustrating when I see other channels that haven't been doing it for very long, maybe like a year or less, and that their channels are just exploding and getting so many more views than ours. Sometimes it starts to get like, I start to feel down about it, I'm just being honest. So instead, I'm just like, it's fine. I'm not gonna look at that stuff. I'm not gonna compare anything. And I'm just going to fake it. We're just gonna fake it till we make it right now. And I know that sounds silly and selfish, but it is how I provide for our family. So I take it seriously and it is a big deal to me. It's not because I want like YouTube fame, but it's because I'm working hard to provide an income for my family. So when I feel like I'm working really hard and you don't see the fruits, sometimes it's frustrating. And that's just the truth of it. So. I just had to get that out there, but I'm gonna let it go now. I'm just gonna move forward, let it go, because you guys are here with us and most of you guys have been with us for a really long time and that means a lot to me. So I don't want to discount you guys because you are our family. You are the MTM fam, you guys right here and we do this, so much of this for you guys. So just shout out to you. It's another beautiful day, I'm gonna show you. See, this is the, we're doing the things that make us happy right now. So I'm gonna get outside and I'm gonna see this beautiful sunshiny day. Would you look at that? Oh my goodness. And there's our little Samson. It's funny because, you know, Jensen like honks when he breathes and something's going on with Samson as he's getting older. He's struggling breathing and it's making us nervous if he's got something going on like in his lungs or something. He's coming over to say hi. Hi buddy. Hey, what's on your leg? What the heck? There's something all over his legs. I'm gonna, come here buddy, come here. Okay, stay, stay. Look at his leg right there. I noticed that his leg was like, had something on it and I just went out into the grass and look what I found, a piece of glass. That means his leg is probably cut. Here, I'm gonna try to get a better look at it, but. Where's it hurt, bud? Can you lay down? Hey. Okay, so I tried to get a really good look at his leg and his paw, and I couldn't tell where it's cut, so I don't know if his mouth was cut, and then he was licking it on his leg, or if you just can't tell anymore, but there was that piece of glass, and I don't really wanna walk out in the grass without shoes on, so I'm gonna get some shoes on, and I'm gonna see if I can find any more glass and figure out how his leg got cut and why there's glass out here. We were gone all day yesterday, so I don't have a clue how this happened. All right, I got some good shoes on to walk around in the grass, and hopefully we can, well, I don't wanna find anything, but if there is anything out there, I want to find it right now. I found that piece over in this area. This is so weird. I feel like I need to walk around the entire yard because it could be anywhere, right? This has me worried. I definitely don't want someone to get cut. All right, I walked around the whole yard. I couldn't see anything else, but I mean, it would be hard to find like a little piece or something in the grass. So I'm just gonna have to tell the kids that they have to wear shoes when they're in the backyard for the next little while till I feel confident that there's nothing else out there. And I, Samson seems okay, poor guy. He's walking around fine, he's not limping, 
So he must be okay, but that is just like the strangest thing ever. I just have no idea how that would have happened. All right, you guys, I'm feeling really guilty that I was complaining this morning because it has been a fine day. So it's good, it's all good. So we're back outside, super excited because they're the Air Force fighter jets are doing like a salute to the healthcare workers and they were they're flying down and back across the state of Utah and they're gonna be doing that in about 15 minutes, 10 minutes. So we're outside waiting. We're just gonna be watching them up in the sky. I think this is such a beautiful tribute and I'm so excited to be able to witness it. All the kids are here with their sunglasses because it's bright out here, huh? <laughs> you ready to see the, the rockets? You can see this little dot. Oh yeah. Oh, there they are! Alright, we are back inside from the jet flyover. That was super quick. I was hoping that we'd get to see them like as they turned around, but I think they went over the mountains over there and headed back down south. So we only got to see them the one time. It was crazy because you know how light travels faster than sound? I think we could have seen them earlier, but it sounded like they were further away. And so we didn't spot them till they were like closer to being above us. So it just seemed like they went by so fast, but it was really cool to see them. And now JJ is awake from his nap and I need to clean up the kitchen. So that is what we're doing right now. OMG guys, something crazy is happening right now. Can they figure out what it is? I can they I figure can it out? Hey. It's mine though. Buddy wants to see it. No, no. Derek okay. is not wearing okay. a red hat. No. It's gray. Don't worry, I have what? red too. I wish I would have had the camera out because quite literally, the second I walked in, I was like, whoa, wh what's up with your hat? And then Bodhi walks in and he's like, whoa, where's your red hat? And then Brielle walks in, whoa, where's your hat? Like Derek wearing a red hat is just kind of him. So for him having the gray hat on, it's just throwing everybody off. Just everybody do what you're supposed to do. Like Derek, just wear your red hat. It's not that hard. Oh my goodness, the sweetest thing happened. She fell asleep downstairs. Cozy fell asleep downstairs. We have to show you this crazy thing that we noticed tonight. Apparently rashes are our coronavirus thing. She's got this rash on her feet. You can't see it very well. You can kind of see the spots on that side of her foot. What did you say? Rashes or coronavirus thing? What did you <laughs> no, say? Because Jay had his rash too. Oh, I'm not making thing. sense. It's I'm our thing. thing. But then look at this hand. What the heck? Any dermatologists out there? She's Both of her hands and feet are covered. So this is so strange. So we are going to maybe end up taking her in tomorrow to figure out what's going on. And it's also, I didn't show, it's also showing up on the bridge of her like nose and cheeks. And so I was wondering if, could it possibly be the sun? Because she got a little bit pink yesterday, like at Bear Lake and the tops of her hands and her feet. I don't know. It's just so weird the places that it's showing up in. So we'll see, but isn't that crazy? But so cute that she fell asleep downstairs. She said it's a little sweetheart. Is she in bed now? Jay's vlogging. Oh, Jay's vlogging too. Okay. Are you vlogging here? Look at Are this. Are you vlogging? Yes. JJ, say hello. Hi. Say hi, guys. Say, what's up, guys? Welcome to my channel. <laughs> what's he doing? All right, so Cosette is in bed now. Little angel girl. And now we gotta get the rest of these little monkeys in bed. But I wanted to do a funny experiment with Jensen and the red hat and the gray hat and see which ones he thinks that Derek should wear. Okay, so all the kids definitely had an opinion about what color hat Derek wore. Jay's so now we're gonna see what color of hat that Jay thinks Derek should wear. Okay, Jay, what do you think, buddy? Which one is daddy's? Which one? Which There's one is daddy's hat? new gray. There's new red on red. Ooh, so new fancy. Hello. Oh, and the, the regular. Oh, we don't have enough space. Or the regular. Which Where's one, Where's daddy's Jay? hat? Which one? Where's daddy's, where's hat. daddy's hat? <laughs> Give it to daddy. You like this one? He picked it. He picked the original. Is this the one dad wears every day? Oh, fuck. Should we try that one? Put it on. Oh, JJ wear that one, huh? Oh, 
so cute. <laughs> cool, show mom. Go look at mom. Oh my goodness, look that was so cute. Like he's just the boss. Jay, where's he going? He's, got a, he's probably going to look in the mirror. Okay, so basically I think that sums it up. Derek is only allowed to wear that one hat for the rest of forever. Right, Brielle? Yeah. Is this the one you guys like better? It's just, just so... It's so weird seeing him it's, in a different yeah. hat. And no, everyone I, agreed on the red, so I think I that's, that's what it is. Yeah, it's the same style. I don't know, this one's okay. I mean, no, it's not that we don't like the other ones. We like the other ones, it just doesn't seem like yeah. it fits him. Let's see it, JJ. Okay, Let's see it. He turned, so oh, so cute. He is so handsome. Try this one. He, he wants he you really, to wear the red he, one. He does not want me to wear a hat other than that one. Jay, how does this one look? Is that awesome? Oh, look at that smile. Is this one okay? <laughs> he says, take that one off, Dad. Take it off, get it, get it, get it. There you go. He's like, this one's mine. You wear your own. Which one's Daddy's? Which one, Where's Jay? Daddy's hat? Where's Daddy's hat? Daddy's. Daddy's. Mm. Put, it so put, it put it on my head. Put it on. Put it on. Uh-oh. Knuckles. Knuckles. <laughs> Oh my goodness. He's getting so big. Oh, oh so my cute. little buddy. Do you like it? What do you think, bud? Do you like it this way? Ooh. So cool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, Jay. Do you like it? He's such a sweet boy. What is that? He's just, face I don't know. Making? He's loving it. He's just. <laughs> 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 oh, he's so handsome. Oh, he almost got me. Hi. You showing Brielle? Went on backwards again? He's loving it. He, he, he's feeling so big. He's looking so big. Hey. That's the official hat of Jay. Mm -hmm. I love it. You look awesome, bud. I think he decided it's the, that's the official hat of you. Yeah? Well, looks better on him. It's time to get him into bed. Okay, kids are in bed, and of course, mom and I just sat down to watch some, some YouTube, and she yes. was just totally crying. So were you. I what? Don't throw me under the bus like you that. You were crying. They have to think I'm tough. If I cried, you know he cried. Touche. I'm, I'm a big baby. But in this case, so we, we've we heard a lot about this, John Krasinski's uh, some. some Good News. Mm -hmm. It's good. We were crying watching it. It was yeah. so, it just, it got us. We needed some good news. It, it wasn't just the good news. It's just showing the, just the love for humanity, love for people, love for goodness. And, and you know, for some reason this week, I've actually had a little bit, I focused a little bit too much on the negativity, like negative comments, negative things that people say or do or, you know, and, and that just drags you down. Mm -hmm. it, whereas stuff like this just makes you remember there is so much good in this world. And way bigger things to care about and think about and put your oh, focus geez. on. And, yeah. Oh, so if you guys need a little pick-me-up, go watch it. You'll shed some tears. Some good news. John Krasinski. You'll find it. That's all you need. And uh, it's just amazing. I love good people. Yeah, that was fun. Okay, well, thanks for hanging out with us today. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Love you. See you then. Bye.